Mr. Nutshell here. Deliver this message, please. Your comfort zone is on fire. You're the only able first responder to rescue. Dreams and goals need dedication to pursue. To live fully is to welcome every challenge. Seeking comfort is self-sabotage by avenge. Our comfort zone is unsuitable for growth because it does not value our realist worth. As long as we're too cozy in our comfort zone, we'll never reach or sit happily on our throne. Comfort zone is the most dangerous place. It tells us to quit and drop out of the race. Bands, gift, talent usage, just to name a few. It prevents us from trying something new. The arsonist set your comfort zone on fire. Run, you say in bold style, before you expire. Our comfort zone encourages us to settle, persuades us to give up before the battle, instructs us to avoid all risk and chances, teaches us to avoid any other advances. Comfort zone stunts our journey to success, blocks and restricts our desire to progress. It locks us in a prison of permanent recess. We choose the wrong choices and digress. Our comfort zone is a dream and goal killer. It deters us from being a mastermind driller. Although it's comfy, it makes us very furious, discourages us to act, do, and think curious. The arsonist set your comfort zone on fire. Run, you say in bold style, before you expire. Comfort zone's mission is procrastination. Offers zero encouragement and motivation. It slows us down to lazy pace, holding us back. Makes us like a daisy color and steers us off track. Our comfort zone does not put us to the test. Always at rest, it results in our worst, not best. Living in your comfort zone is so destructive. Explore your strength zone to be productive. Try whatever puts fear in you. Go experiment. It is vital for improvement and development to discover whatever you're passionate about. Abandon your comfort zone without a doubt. The arsonist set your comfort zone on fire. Run, you say in bold style, before you expire. Judge Nutshell here. So your complaint is the arsonist set 
your comfort zone on fire? So how long have you been sitting in your comfort zone? 20 years? You can't be serious. He rescued you from self-destruction. You should say thank you. He was being a good Samaritan. I am not throwing him in jail. He did not break the law. No, ma'am. He did not break the law. I am not putting him in jail. You already did the 20 years for him. No, ma'am. He did not break the law. He upheld the law in this case. Mr. Asinist, please do me a favor. Any other comfort zone that you see, please set them on fire for me. You are doing a great job by motivating humanity. We need more people like you in the world. Miss Comfort Zone, please stay out of my courtroom with your nonsense. Find your purpose in life. Find your purpose in life. It's time to start living your dreams. It's time to start living your dreams. Stop wasting time. Stop wasting time. All the charges are dropped. Both of you are free to leave. And this case is dismissed. This case is dismissed. Yes, I am serious. Of course, I am serious. This case is dismissed. She got some nerve. She got some nerve. I have never seen anything like this in my 25 years as a judge. She got some nerve to come in here with such foolishness. She got some nerve. Hey, you, you, yes, you, your comfort zone is on fire. <laughs> your comfort zone is on fire. Please let me know in the comments below if this message resonated with you. Please prescribe and subscribe to my YouTube channel, Miss Nutshell. Thanks for watching. Thanks for sharing. Live positive. Yeah, man.